My name is Rita Sorting. I work for Royal Mail. I do sorting together with flat machine. It's all about putting it into the direct holes. It goes into the direct as, as far as you can read the postcode, you put it straight into the holes. And that's it. And at the end of it, you, you dispatch it out. My job is it's not a it's not so it's not a hard work. It's very relaxing and it's not a work that can stress someone out. It doesn't stress me out. You meet people, you work with people, different people, so I enjoy working in Royal Mail, yeah. I joined Royal Mail in nineteen ninety nine, December period, as a casual. So I started working with them as a uh, for three month contract. They renew the contract and then I become full time staff as a postwoman. And I was doing going out for delivery to and then coming to sort letters. And I've worked there for almost eight eight years. I went to the Lagos State Polytechnic in Nigeria before coming down here. I wanted to become uh, a secretary because that is my field. My parents were not here. I came with my uncle and then from then I decided to stay. Coming down to England is one of my, the, one, of, one of the things that I can say it changed my life, yeah. Because uh, I see myself that if I'm still back home, I, maybe I wouldn't have be up to what I am now. I did some little courses, like I want to uh, become a nurse, but I see that I don't, I don't, I can't suit in because I don't like seeing like blood, things like that. So then I move away from that field. So uh, I see that because of my sectarian course, it's something to do with papers, mails, and real mail is something like that. So I, I then decided to join into real mail. Now, because I've worked so far with Royal Mail for 10 years now, I'm planning if I can go and all these skills that I've learned from Royal Mail to go and implement it down to, in Nigeria, to go and create something like Royal Mail, if by God's grace, if I have, yeah, I want to. Because in Nigeria, where I come from, we don't have something like this. I've got four children. I've got four boys. Because I didn't reach to the level I want to, so I want my children to become good person in life. I spoke to my big boy that I would like him to become an engineer. Like my son told me that it's not what I want that matters, it's what he wants. So he's, he's interested in football, which I'm trying to, I'm backing him up because of that. I know if I'm still in Nigeria then, my dad will have encouraged me more to go to uni from there. But because I traveled that way, so because of that, I'm trying to put, let my, my boys go higher than me.